Welcome one and all, Nyanka here, and uh, this is just a little update video for you guys. So, I have a new studio! <laughs> yeah, that's also why I've been quite quiet recently, is I've been moving rooms! <laughs> um, I decided that I couldn't keep doing it out of my bedroom if I wanted to, like, grow my channel and make some decent content. So, yeah, new room! I got a sofa in the background, as you can see, because um, I have some ideas from, for some new videos that will be involving that in the future. I've also got some like wall hangings and stuff that need to hang at the back, but I haven't got to that yet. I decided that I'd left you guys waiting long enough for some new content. I do apologise for how long I've been quiet. I know I've also been very quiet on social media too. Um, again, I was so busy trying to get this sorted and everything moved and set up that I just kind of ran out of energy at the end of each day. So I also had some help uh, setting this all up and everything. Uh, but yay, new studio, new rooms, new content, woo! <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to be recording in here from now on. Uh, I'm hoping to get back to my schedule of Monday, Wednesday, Friday for content. Uh, we will see. I do have um, some family stuff coming up in the next few weeks, so it might not work out at completely as planned, but I'm hoping to. If not, I'll let you guys know, um, like, through Twitter probably. So, like, yeah, go follow me on Twitter and Instagram. I'll leave links again in the description uh, so that you guys can go do that. Um, and that way you can just keep... I'll do better with social media and keeping you guys up to date. So, yes. What do you guys think of the new room? Tell me down in the comments. Do you think that I should do more colours? Or do you think that I should get some more decorations? Um, yeah, input is always welcome. And I am really looking forward to being able to record some more stellar content for you guys that doesn't look quite so half assed considering it was in my bedroom. I'm so embarrassed about that. But I was just so excited to get started that um, I started recording in my bedroom before... I managed to get this room set up because this room used to be like a spare room. Like it's still a spare room now, but there's no giant bed now where I'm currently sat. There used to be a bed here um, and there used to be wardrobes now where, um, where the sofas were. So we had to move everything around and take the sofa, like bring the sofa bed in, take the big beds out uh, and get everything set up, get a desk. That was fun. Managed to get my desk actually from, I think it was Dundeal. Um, woman in the area was selling it pretty cheap and we were like yeah because fun fact Amazon is crap when it comes to gaming desks <laughs> we um, well I went and ordered three and it was just the first one never got dispatched it was like three weeks and they hadn't even taken the money out of my account so I was like hmm I'm gonna cancel you because this feels like a scam ordered a second desk <clears throat> That didn't work out either. <laughs> Again, didn't take the money, never got dispatched, so cancelled that. And we thought, you know, maybe third time's the charm. I'll get a third attempt and off we go. And no, that one didn't happen either. So I got so frustrated. It's like, I'm just not going to get a desk. It's not going to happen. <laughs> and then I decided to maybe give, you know, a done deal and adverts that I uh, a go. Because sometimes people are wanting to flog their stuff cheap. Or just get rid of it because they're moving or they're getting new stuff in. And luckily, I found this desk, which is a nice corner desk. I am very happy with it. Uh, got a pretty decent price as well. Uh, yeah, drove over, picked it up. The woman was lovely. Uh, disassembled it and then brought it home and reassembled it. <laughs> um, this was all while I was recovering from surgery as well. So that was fun. A friend of mine came with, did the dismantling, helped me out, and I was dosed up on painkillers. was not a fun trip. I shouldn't have done it, but, you know, needs must. <laughs> and, yeah, so, new desk. I got my computer. I got a new mic, actually. I'm not sure if you can see it. Let's see. Yeah, new mic. Uh, I got that as a birthday present, actually. Because, yeah, March is my birthday month. I won't be telling you what day, but, yeah. Uh, if any time, like, it gets, um, if recording and uploads get, like, spotty in March, it's because it's over my birthday month and I don't like, especially the week of my birthday, I always used to, when I was working, try and take it off, um, just, you know, chillax, have some new time, recharge, that kind of thing, enjoy, you know, being alive, considering, you know, birthdays. <laughs> I always think that you should celebrate them and party as hard as you can because you never know if tomorrow is going to happen for you or not. That is my view on life, um. 
you know, party like there's no tomorrow, but don't be mean. So yeah, you know, my creed is love, light, acceptance, and just live life to the fullest because you don't know when tomorrow's going to end, you know, or if tomorrow's even going to come around for you. Um, so yeah, Nyanka's words to live by. <laughs> um, so yes, I've got, as you can see, my gaming collection in the background. I might be playing a lot of these games. I have to figure out actually how to hook up the old systems to the recording equipment and we'll go from there. But yeah, I've got a lot of games that I'm hoping to play. Um, actually, Uncharted is one of them because I um, went and saw the Uncharted movie recently uh, in cinemas. I went with a friend, Ugh, did all of the the outing abouting recently because I had a small holiday as well. That's also why I disappeared. But like I said, birthday month, so I went on a small holiday trip and me and my friends went to the cinema and saw Uncharted. And I have to say, I've seen some of the gameplay. I've never actually played the games fully myself, which is what I'm hoping to do on the channel in the future. But I really enjoyed Uncharted. It wasn't really Uncharted. It was more just like another national treasure or, you know, Indiana Jones. But... You know, Tom Holland was hot, so I could I could accept it. <laughs> uh, it was pretty funny. Uh, the action was good. I mean, overall, it was a, a decent movie. I'd rate it like a B in terms of overall, like, greatness. The fact that it had Antonio Banderas in it, like, hikes it up to, like, an A. But I'm a huge Antonio Banderas fan. And the fact he was speaking Spanish in it as well was just like, Mwah. Oh, I didn't even need the subtitles for that because I speak Spanish. Um, I'm also learning Japanese, like I said. Uh... But yeah, I have an update on that in in a future video. Uh, so yeah, anyway, back to Uncharted. Uh, was good. Most of the movie, B tier. Antonio Banderas' scenes, A tier. Not much more I can say to that. Uh, go give it a look if you want to. I mean, I know a lot of fans are quite upset that the casting wasn't right. And I have to admit, there's several parts where I was watching it going, this is just Spider-Man. <laughs> But I had only just watched um, Spider-Man Homecoming, uh, No Way Home, recently. Was it No Way Home? The third one, anyway. Ugh, my brain. Um, I just watched that recently enough, anyway. And um, so he was still really fresh in my mind as Spider-Man. And I was like, oh my god. And I just have to say, Mark Wahlberg was the worst choice in the world for Sully. There's plenty of other actors that could do better. And I'm probably going to put pictures here of who I think those guys should have been. But, you know... It was overall an enjoyable movie. Go watch it if you want. Don't if you don't. Tell me your views on it down in the comments below as well. And we can have a discussion. Um, you know, don't bash me for my views. I won't bash you for yours. <laughs> so, mm. oh, also while I was away, um, I nearly saw the Batman, but I didn't in the end. I wish I had. But, uh, yeah, I decided on Uncharted instead because I just wanted something that was fun and easy to follow along with because I've been a bit brain dead recently. Very mushy brained, but I think that's probably still after effects from my surgery. I always feel a bit blah after surgery for like two months. And then I find you come back around and it's like, woo, yay, party. And I also end up acting like I have ADHD. I do not, by the way, but I am very scatterbrained. <laughs> so that will probably come across in my videos at times. I do apologize in advance for that. But yes, uh, this was just a small little video to update you on the current events of things and just to let you guys know what was happening in life. I have a load of new ideas set up that I'm going to be recording in this room for you in the foreseeable future. I should hopefully be back to my three time a week posting schedule from next week. And I think that's about all she wrote at the moment. Is it? Hmm. Yeah, cool thinking face. <laughs> yeah, probably more, but I can always update you on that in, uh, you know, new videos in the future. And yes, I thank you ever so much for joining me uh, for this short little video. I hope you liked it. If you do like the video, like I've said before, comment on anything that you want to leave a comment on that I've talked about, or even just, you know, how was your day in general? Let me know. I'd love to find out. And yeah, I will probably see you in the next one. I mean, considering I'm filming it. It, it's a good it's a good guess that you'll see me in the next one anyway take care my kittens all of my love i've been yanka and i will see you in the next one au revoir